Hi, Jeremy here with the Disc Jockey News at the Marquee Show in beautiful Chicago. Brings me over to the Denon DJ booth. Denon has got a fantastic, fantastic mixer that they put out. I've got Chris here who's going to tell us a little bit about it. And the biggest thing that I want to know, Chris, and what I want you to talk about is, there's Chris, is, uh, and Shondi in back, hi there. <laughs> and uh, she's, she's spinning the tunes. Um, one thing I want to talk about is, uh, DJs that go from basically a computer DJ that uses one of the computer formats to using just this without a computer. So I'm going to give you the microphone and tell us a little bit about making that switch over and what I would need to do that. All right. Thanks, guys. Yeah, it's a really easy transition, guys. Um, no more computer use whatsoever needed. This is an awesome new uh, DJ console that you guys can use, standalone. has a lot of features where you can use an SD disk. SD card, sorry, I'll give you an S, uh, thumb drives, two thumb drive options. You can connect external hard drive in the back. You also can charge your phone, you can charge um, your, lap, uh, your uh, iPad or any other mobile device in the back as well. And then we have a built-in hard drive option, it's a caddy. So if you guys are familiar with the uh, laptop size hard, uh, internal hard drives, that's the size that you need Then put inside this unit. And it could be standal it could be a, a flash drive, it could be the regular hard drives, however, whatever you want, uh, it does not matter. Um, I best believe we test this up to uh, four terabytes. So it's pretty big. You can put pretty big uh, uh, hard drive inside this unit. So a uh, lot of options right there off the bat, you know, just using it by itself. This is a standalone unit, guys. This is built-in effects, built-in sync if you use sync, built-in internal effects. You have uh, four effects here. Uh, plenty of effects. You can do chain effects as well as, as well here. You can do hall echo. You can do uh, ping pong. You can do auto gate. You can do um, flanger. You can do filter LFO and so forth. There's tons of them that you can do all together. It's a real easy to use, easy to see and, and uh, read. And one thing I want to also point out: look at the waveforms are straight across now. So we just did a we just did a new update today, literally today, 1.3.2. Um, update for uh, for this unit. So for the Prime 4, it now can go across or up and down. Uh, you have the options of going four channels uh, across, or you can do up and down four channels as well. So that's huge for you guys who are mi used to mixing straight across. No worries, we got you covered. Okay, so I, got, I, got, I got a couple questions, so I'm going to really dumb this down. So. All I have to do basically is just have my music ready to go on my hard drive or my thumb drive, show up at a gig, plug in, and I'm, I'm good to go. Exactly. You can, this, this can read music on the fly. It really can. Uh, it'll take about two to three seconds to analyze it, sure. but it can read on the fly. So you can do that, or you want a nice, seamless, easy to go songs from one to another, use our engine library. It's free. Download that at denondj.com. You basically just take all your music. Um, if you have Serato right now, let's say for instance, you open up Engine software, you can take your crates from Serato and then simply uh, put it in the engine on your thumb drive on, on, in the engine software, analyze everything, and it'll save your cue points, your loops, and all that stuff. So it's an easy transition from Serato to Engine. Uh, you can just, it now reads Tractor, it reads Record Box. Um, all those main music uh, DJ softwares, it will actually analyze all that right inside our engine. Uh, software. So I would recommend for e easy, seamless transitioning from song to song and uh, ID3 tags and everything like that. Use our engine software. It's really easy to use. Um, you, can, you can create playlists. You can create crates. Um, I don't know if you want to take a little quick, you can do playlists. This is the crates playlist um, where you can prepare tracks. Uh, it's my engine library. And even where you want to search stuff. Just simply just you can hit here, hit the search button and type in you know whoever you want. You want the new DJ Snake song, hit DJ Snake, and all of your songs from him or remixes from him will pop up. It's that easy. Very easy to do. Real quick, very, and you can see how clear the screen is. It's a high definition screen, everything's touch screen. And um, if you wanted to record right on the fly, you can do that. Hit start here, boom, I'm recording. And then once you're done recording your set, hit stop, and you save it right to your thumb drive right here. It saves directly right on whatever device you connect to. And if you have, and you have, and if you have two thumb drives connected, you will be able to select which one you want to uh, save it to. Is there a significance in having two thumb drives or one? Uh, no. Okay. It does, no, no, it doesn't no, matter. No, doesn't matter. It does not matter. Okay. 
and does it matter if it's USB 2 or USB 3? Uh, I would recommend USB 3. Okay, you would. Yep. Yes, okay. yes. At this point in time, uh, y'all should have 3.0 3 at this time. So. <laughs> correct, correct. And, look, and one last thing I want to point out. Look at this. That's, I'm DJ Adepta. I'm from, I'm from the Boston Providence area. And you can see your logo is right there in the middle. It's so easy to do now. Now you can put all you can put your DJ logo free advertisement. Um, Shani also did hers as well. Um, free advertisement right there, right on your platters. It's so easy to do. Uh, it's a it's basically it's a PNG uh, 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 file. It's 600 by 600. You put it right on the root folder. So you you put it in your engine folder, and you just, that's it. You put it label as logo.png, and it will put up your logo in every single song you play. It's that easy. It's that. It's awesome. Um, this is so much cool stuff you guys can do on this stuff. It's fun. It's it's uh, reliable. Um, it it you can tilt the screen too. So if you, you know if you're in some if you're out, outdoors or something you have a uh, a sunlight problem you can you can uh, obviously do you can fix yourself and also it has a nice velvet cover. So when you're done or you're taking a rest, oh, put it right on top right there. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. Everything is top of the line, built inside, XLRs. Every single sound output is XLR. So no RCA output, no quarter inch. You get top of the line, then in DJ sound, microphone takeover, uh, talk over as well. Um, again, four channels. And one last thing I want to point out is our zone out, which is great for you wedding DJs. My God, this is such a cool uh, saver right here. The zone out is uh, it's an auto playlist. So on channel four, um, basically you would just load up whatever crate you have for your cocktail hour or something like that, and you put that on, uh, you hit the zone button, and it'll ask you, well, apparently you can't do it with the, um, with the, the waveform that's going left or right, but if, if you change the waveform, if you, uh, hold on one second. So when it goes up and down like this, you hit zone, it'll tell you you want to stop, blah, 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 hit okay, and then it, right here is your zone, this is channel four, uh, and basically what you do is you select a crate and um, usually what I do is go here I send the zone and then right there you're playing you just and you can adjust your zone accordingly however you like and you do one track to another so look at the deck here see how it's kind of this this is channel this is deck two and it's all lit up deck four is not lit up that's telling you hey you're using zone you can't hit this and mess up something you know it's okay. this is autoplay it makes you mem uh, mentally and visually see that you're in that zone output and you can just go from one song to another you know in your in your crate it's so easy to use it's amazing it's a great feature for all you wedding DJs and and corporate um, DJs as well so more information online where do they find that at Chris? log on to www.denanddj.com hey, thank you very much Chris no problem thanks for having me guys <laughs>